Greetings, it's Maxo Diddly, and today I'm going to be showing you how to 9 slice sprites in Unity and why you should do it. So let's get right into it. Firstly, I'm going to drag and drop an, an image you're going to use into my Unity project. It's just a really simple curved square. We're not going to touch the import settings yet. And we're going to go to our canvas, we're going to right click, we're going to go to UI and go to image. And we're going to drag and drop our curved box onto the image. And we've got this. It's low resolution, however it demonstrates the point. So let's say we've got this nice little box with the curved corners and we want to make it bigger. Or you might be thinking, okay Max, you can, I don't know, change the width and set it to 400. But notice something. Unless we were to also do the height by 400, the curve gets kind of destroyed. And this looks horrible. But we can fix this really easily with how we set up the sprite. So let's delete the image and go to our sprite. Keep all of the settings the same and click on Sprite Editor. And in this Sprite Editor, we're going to keep everything the same, but we're going to drag some stuff about. So you see these green boxes? We're going to drag them. You're going to need to drag this differently depending on your image, but I'm going to show you an example. So we're going to do length of 30 for the left border. We're also going to do a length of 30 for the right border to keep it symmetrical. The top border, the top green box, we're going to drag down. We'll also do 30. And I'm not sure if you've noticed, but when we dragged this one down, more boxes have appeared. I'm going to drag the bottom border up to, let's say, also be 30 to keep it all symmetrical. And... We've got nine sections to our sprite, slicing the sprite nine times into nine different sections. So we've got two top corners, we've got two bottom corners, we've got a middle section, and then we've got left, right, up and down sections as well. And we're going to click on apply. And we're going to go to our UI, we're going to go to image, and we're going to make a new image. We'll drag the spliced sprite onto the image, and it looks the same. However, what if we set the width to be 400? As you can see, it's preserved the integrity of the corners. And that is nine sprite slicing in Unity. It's really good for UI stuff. It doesn't have to be UI, you can use this on the regular sprite as well. But, look, we've now got a nice looking input field. Obviously, increase the resolution of the image so it looks less pixelated when you resize it, but thanks for being a great audience. Be sure to leave a like and a comment if you enjoyed, and subscribe for more tutorials. Thanks for watching.